In the heart of the sleepy town of Harmony, nestled amidst rolling hills and patchwork farms, stood the Rusty Nail, a bar that had been a cornerstone of the community for generations. Its walls were lined with faded photographs of local legends and the air was thick with the scent of spilled beer and sawdust. For as long as anyone could remember, the Rusty Nail had been owned by the O'Malley family, a clan known for their fiery tempers and unwavering loyalty. Behind the bar stood Liam O'Malley, the last of his line, a man with a heart as warm as the whiskey he poured and a temper as quick as a whip. Liam was a man of few words, but those words carried weight, especially when they were backed up by his formidable fists. One fateful day, a new face appeared in harmony, Tony the Shark Rizzo, a small-time mobster with big ambitions. Tony had set his sights on the rusty nail, believing it to be a valuable piece of real estate that could be turned into a lucrative gambling den. He approached Liam with an offer sell the bar or face the consequences. Liam, however, was not one to be intimidated. The rusty nail was more than just a bar to him, it was a symbol of his family's legacy, a place where he belonged. He refused Tony's offer, and so began a war between the small town bartender and the big city mobster. Tony tried every trick in the book to get his hands on the bar. He threatened, he bribed. He even tried to sabotage the place. But Liam was always one step ahead, thwarting Tony's every move. The townspeople of Harmony watched the battle unfold with bated breath. They had always known that the O'Malley's were a tough bunch, but they never imagined they would take on a mobster. As the conflict escalated, Liam found himself increasingly isolated. Tony had cut off his supplies. His friends were afraid to be seen with him, and the sheriff, who was in Tony's pocket, turned a blind eye to the mobster's activities. But Liam was not one to give up. He knew that he had to protect his family's legacy, and he was willing to do whatever it took. One night, Liam hatched a daring plan. He would break into Tony's office and steal the deed to the rusty nail. It was a risky move but it was the only way to save the bar. With the help of his two best friends, Kane and Harold, Liam put his plan into action. They snuck into Tony's office, avoiding the mobster's guards and dodging laser beams. Finally, they found the deed, hidden in a safe behind a painting. As they were making their escape, they were caught by Tony and his goons. A fierce fight ensued, and Liam and his friends were outnumbered. Just when it seemed like all hope was lost, the townspeople of Harmony arrived, armed with pitchforks and shovels. They had heard the commotion and had come to support Liam. Tony and his goons were no match for the townspeople's fury. They were quickly overpowered and arrested. Liam was hailed as a hero, and the rusty nail was saved. The bar continued to be a cornerstone of the community for years to come, a testament to the spirit of harmony and the courage of one man who stood up to a mobster.